morning we all have a dream and i think even listening to good music takes us to our dreams dreams of joy dreams of emotion and it is this very thing that my interest in listening to a lot of music took me to a dream of thinking about the sounds of music i was very fascinated when i was listening to a group of symphony orchestra or a team of musicians like here we have a single cello being played but when it comes in a group the rich sound of a group of cello players is much different from what happens when a single cello player plays the music when the composition is the same similarly if you take a violin player a solo violin player and you have a group of violinists so i was always very puzzled as to what was happening i mean why i could feel some real enriched symphonic sound similarly if you see the group of musicians here in a symphony orchestra and then we when we come to the indian context if we have pandit ravi shankar playing the sitar alone if he is playing with his daughter anushka shankar the same composition two sitars being played at the same time or if you have pandit shiv kumar sharma playing the santur he playing with his son on the santur two santurs being played or for that matter ustad amjad ali khan giving a solo performance or playing with both his sons the same composition like you have three sarods being played at the same time that is much the sound is much different than a single sarod being played this dream kept me puzzling for a long time and i was thinking that i am a single guitar player can i get the sound of two guitars in my single hawaiian guitar is it possible and that took me on a journey of exploration like now i will play a small piece which will sound like a single hawaiian guitar being played now let us add one more guitar to this hawaiian guitar let's make it two hawaiian guitars similarly if we can combine a raga with another western or a pop number let us see what happens on this guitar
and then once this idea came I had to go to Kolkata because my guitar maker Mr. Mohammad Arif is at Kolkata. Then when I sat in his workshop again as I say innovation has its own limitations. I was looking for I said this maybe sky is the limit so we sat we started he started working on the guitar then he gave me the guitar in my hand I started playing but the sound was not coming I was I had something in mind and it was not happening so I again discussed with him he did a little bit changes in the string placements and again I played again it didn't happen and this went on for some time and then finally I was pleased I, I, I had got the sound what I wanted but then as I said innovation has its limitations I went a little further I said can you make it a little better then he said no if I try then it will get spoiled so that's very important that we dream and then we need to pursue the dream and then even here innovation has its own surprises because after the Javan guitar was made then I was playing it and finally I found it had the tonal quality of more than one musical instrument I mean how does a Javan guitar sound does it sound like a Sarod, a Veena, a Surbahar or a Sitar so I was also very amazed with what is happening and now let's listen to it Thank mm -hmm. you. 
so I think we all need to pursue our dreams and I'm sure they always come as an innovation and this is a very nice platform of TEDx to share this with the whole world. Thank you.